despite a huge operation to prevent the memoir being leaked. This is back, we're back to Harry now. Both The Guardian and The Sun managed to obtain copies. The book also accidentally went on sale early on in Spain, with one lucky customer managing to grab two editions. The upcoming autobiography details an alleged fight in which his older brother, the future British King Prince William, Pushed him to the floor, that's according to the Guardian. In another section, the Duke of Sussex allegedly tells the king and queen consort's relationship and how he and his brother begs Charles not to marry Camilla. There we go. Uh, but is it all getting out of hand? Was he right to go public? To break this down further, I am joined by royal broadcaster Helen Achard and reality TV star and commentator Narinda Kaur. Fantastic stuff, both of you. Right, OK, Helena, I will start with you. Difficult to know exactly where to start with this Prince Harry stuff. Yeah. Um, I mean, do you have any more sympathy for him now that William slapped him around a bit? I didn't hear your beginning bit, but I think it was, look, you know, I've got to say this is just unravelling like a reality TV show. That's what I would say. It's unbelievable. Um, yes, OK, it's alleged that there were some fisticuffs going on. Doesn't this happen in families? It happens all the time. Um, it's something that is... Absolutely inevitable. But do you go out and air your dirty laundry in public? No, you don't. Um, I feel okay. the royal family with the dignified silence. Absolutely. Um, there are things that really don't make sense. It, it's it's absurd. And I cannot believe uh, uh, the things that Harry is coming out with. It's just something okay. that needs to be spoken amongst the family. Narinda, great to have you back on the show. You're right. you're here more than I am, Narinda. To be fair, these days, but uh, I believe you've got you've got you've got kids. I think, haven't you? I mean, they must knock each other about a little bit every now and again. Yes, actually, my, my daughter and son, he said he, 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 she scratched all his hand. But no, I just agree with Helen. There's so much. This, this, this line, this weak argument that the British stiff upper lip and the royal family dignified silence, it's not dignified, it's toxic. Harry is telling you it's toxic. And actually, William, if you're saying, oh, we all hit each other and as kids we can hit each other, you're en enabling physical violence. That's disgusting. You're enablers. How can you defend Prince William attacking his brother? He's a bully, William. Meghan may be rude, Meghan may be plenty of things, but William is coming across as a bully who attacks his brother. It's disgusting. It's toxic. All right, a couple of the other revelations, of course, as well, Helena, that supposedly William and Kate planted the seed of thought in Harry's mind that he should wear a Nazi uniform complete with swastika armband to a fancy dress party. I mean, some people would say it's a bit thick to actually wear it, Helena. You know, um, first of all, I have to say that I think it's a bit ignorant to sort of state uh, a one-sided story. So we, we cannot just go out and, and, and you know, cull somebody, um, as your guest ha has just done. Um, I just feel, you know, Harry has to take responsibility. Harry wore the outfit. Um, whether allegedly uh, William and Kate had anything to do with that, that that's to see. But, you know, you can't always be passing the buck mm. you know he has to take responsibility okay um, well, all i see at the moment is envy and, and some kind of revenge and i to, don't understand it yeah to be fair as well it's probably important for me to say at this point on buckingham palace kensington palace as it currently stands are refusing to comment on it so it is very much a one-sided story we don't know whether or not william denies all this stuff we can only go off, off. story patrick because william has betrayed harry he plants these stories he goes through his sources so let's stop this this line of oh it's a one-sided story william has done enough damage he's given his story is he's secretly given his lines to his palace aides and his forces right. and he's damaged Harry. No, he's Narinda, I, I get that, but I don't know whether or not you've got brothers or sisters, Narinda, but I would do. you, is it right, is it really okay to come out and slam them in public like this? You sort it out behind closed doors, Narinda, don't you? It's a bit no, low rent, it's I, a bit I, cheap. I, I if my brothers and sisters went public, then I would also have to go public. But what Harry's saying is, this isn't as dirty as we're all making out to be. He's mm. saying, I want to talk about it because we need to talk about the toxicity in this family. Take away the royal family. They're just two humans. They suffer childhood trauma and they, and they had a dreadful father who had an affair with, it, with, with his, with, with his oh. lover against their mother's back. It's disgusting what them two have been through. And Charles has done nothing. Charles has been cruel with his son. Harry desperately wants them back.